The word disease, as we know it today, stems from a Middle English word that literally translate to lack of ease. And if dis-ease is a state of sickness in the body, then it makes sense to conclude that a state of ease is one that brings us back to health. Ease is where we are meant to be. Can it really be that easy? Let's dive deeper in just a minute. Welcome to this episode of Hometown Health, hosted by Dr. Dan of Toro Family Chiropractic. There are two simple states that your body can be in. Your body can either be in ease or dis-ease. In a state of ease, your body is functioning at its best and adapting to internal and external environment. You have a healthy response to stress, whether it is physical stress, like exercise or an injury, biochemical stress, like too much pollen or a meal with fried food, or mental emotional stress, like a tough day at work or a hectic activity schedule. Things are adapting well. On the other hand, in a state of dis-ease, your body is not functioning at its best and you are not able to effectively adapt to daily life stresses. You're tired, you're down. The stresses of life are overwhelming you. And then you start to feel symptoms like digestion trouble because that meal wasn't the healthiest choice or headaches because your neck is so tense. The state of dis-ease is not where we are meant to be. Our bodies are designed to be in ease. They are meant to express an optimal physiological function. They are meant to adapt to our environment. They are built to handle everyday stresses without falling apart or getting sick. They are meant to thrive. But when the body is in a hypertense state, overworked, overstressed, limited function, poor adaptability, the parasympathetic nervous system, where ease lives, is inhibited. It cannot do its job. It cannot bring us back to ease. As a chiropractor, my goal is to remove that tension and in doing so, allow the parasympathetic nervous system to restore the natural ease that we are meant to live in. Now, this isn't the same as using a medication to take away the tension. We don't want to shut off the response to the brain. We actually want to do the opposite. We want to make the brain more aware by restoring its communication with the rest of the body and allow it to restore the body's function and most importantly, adaptability. The chiropractic adjustment is designed to restore communication to the parasympathetic nervous system through restoration of spinal motion and alignment. By restoring this communication, the tension in the body will decrease. The body will again function and adapt at its best and begin to return to a state of ease. This may take time depending on how long you have been holding yourself in a stressed out, diseased state, but finding that ease can be life-changing and so worth the time investment. If you are trying to get back to ease and need support, I am happy to help you find your best level of health and healing. If you would like to find out more about this and other health topics, please join us for one of our upcoming community events or connect with me directly about your specific health questions. And remember, I'm here to help you get healthy and stay healthy for life. Thanks for watching Hometown Health with Dr. Dan. To find out if chiropractic care makes sense for you, visit TuroFamilyChiropractic.com.